Hello, and welcome to the 505 tutorial for the isolated PID. In this tutorial, we will review how to make dynamic adjustments to the isolated PID control. It is important for you to know how to do this so that you can tune your controller properly. PID refers to the proportional gain, integral gain, and derivative ratio, all of which are the adjustable and interacting parameters used to match the response of the control loop with the response of the system. The isolated PID controller can be configured to control any system process. Typically, this controller is configured and used to control seal gas or gland seal pressure, but it can also be used for any type of PID loop. To make PID dynamic adjustments, you must be logged in to the service or configure user level and operation mode. Refer to the changing user levels and changing modes and languages tutorials to learn how to do this. To check the user level and mode, press mode. The button for opening the isolated PID screen is located on the second service menu screen. To navigate to this button from the home screen, press the black function key below service. Press the black function key below the right arrow button. Use the navigation cross keys to select isolated controller, then press enter. From the isolated controller screen that opens, you will need to access the screen that allows you to make dynamic adjustments. Scroll through the available menu bar options until you see the Dynamics button. Then press the black function key below Dynamics. The PID Dynamics pop-up window opens, providing you with access to all the PID terms, proportional gain, integral gain, and derivative ratio. To change the values for these parameters, either Use the navigation cross keys and the adjust keys, or use the navigation cross keys, press enter. Use the numeric keypad, and then press enter again. When you're done, press the black function key below close. For a more in-depth explanation of PID tuning, refer to the speed, cascade, and auxiliary dynamics adjustment section of the 505 product manual. When finished, Press either Escape or Home to return to the service menu screen. Press the black function key below Save Settings. Finally, press Home to return to the main screen. You now know the basics of making dynamic adjustments to the isolated PID. Please be sure to view the other tutorials for more information.